going on y'all so today we're going to start the tesla series over here on the youtube and tiktok channels um i just bought a 2022 tesla model 3 long range all-wheel drive edition um we're going to be covering all type of things man from just general information about the car features inside the car you know that come with it the exterior and interior of the car accessories for the car charging you know just general information about teslas just in case anybody wanted to know if they was considered buying one um or you wanted to know more about them then this is going to be the spot for you i appreciate y'all tuning in today and uh, let's get it started man what's up y'all so we're gonna start with the interior of the car of course you know the first thing that people notice is the screen up front it's a 15 inch display um, you pretty much control everything from right here in the car so on this screen actually it doesn't have a gear shift like most traditional cars that people may be used to you actually control everything with this stock over here you'll put your foot on the brake you'll go up for reverse all your cameras will pop up show you your lines and everything like that you still got to pay attention to your surroundings of course but it's pretty good help then you go down for drive, you know, shows you when you're on the highway. My other car over there and it's uh, showing it on the screen and stuff. You'll press the button in to go in the park and everything like that. Um, you got the traditional steering wheel. You got your horn here, your music control and volume right here. And you got voice controls over here. So, you know, I can exit to navigate me somewhere or things like that. Let me show you. I'm hot. Not high. Not high. And then increase the uh, temperature in the car by three degrees. You know, things like that. Um, it's actually pretty cool. You got the regular controls over here for your signals and whatnot. You know, and then when you do turn the signal on, it shows you your blind spot for both sides, whichever one. Um, you know, of course, you got your windows controls over here and everything like that, but it doesn't have a, a real traditional way to get out the car. So you actually press this button here and it lowers the window a little bit and lets you get out. And it rolls it back up. Um, you got your compartments down here, you know, so got to got to keep the diapers on on hand you know got a sign so these are also accessories too right here for these um imports they connect down there this drawer is actually an accessory too because the car just comes with this dip in here you know so something nice to cover it up cup holder of course got this little nice little cover here to go with the nut the nice white interior another cover over here with some things down there you know so it's a, it's a real nice luxury car man so it's different from most cars that people know that they used to let's go to the back seat got the car seat back there for the for my son man so don't mind that that's pretty much the interior man I'll show y'all some more of the screen you can connect to the Bluetooth Apple music Spotify of course you can make calls on there you can bring up your cameras you know just in case you, you can actually have them up while you're driving you got theater mode so when you're charging the car Netflix Hulu Disney Plus YouTube Twitch TikTok follow me on TikTok um, tutorials everything like that you got an arcade mode when you're charging as well. You can play a few games on here, you know. Then, yeah, man, it, it actually does a lot. You can go to the stations, pick songs from the car. You got sentry mode, which pretty much records your surroundings um, from all angles, you know, built in dash cam. So if anybody try anything crazy or something like that, you know, you can get your, your phone your car captures it all so you got a built-in internet browser and everything search up what you want to search anything like that um, 
Yeah, man, that's pretty much it for the interior and the screen side of things. You pretty much control everything from here. You got a whole little menu from the lights to the display to the autopilot, charging, pedals, and steering, and uh, software updates. Kind of like how your phone updates, Tesla updates. So, you know, that's how they that's how they pretty much get their things done for the car. They could put out an update. You got subscriptions you can do, you know, for all type of things. We'll go into more details on that later. So, that's the inside of the car. Let's go to the outside now. So, we also be back. We're going to do the outside of the car now. So, I just uh, kind of went basic with it. Got the white one. So, yeah. You know, I got my anime stickers. <laughs> so the car actually didn't come with a lot of what y'all see now so i got these things added on kind of went for a carbon fiber type of thing got something to protect the cameras i put these uh black wheel covers on different than what the car actually came with for the doors more carbon fiber more anime stickers Open butthole. <laughs> this is actually where you charge the car at. So, close it. You got another one. Open the front. Actually, you know, electric car, so I don't have an engine up front. So, I got another trunk. Put things up in there as well. Bad. You got your sunroof and everything like that. So, yeah, man, that's pretty much the outside. Real flashy, fancy type of car. So, now we can go for a drive. We're gonna go for a drive. Show y'all how the car drives, how fast it is, and everything like that. So. No, safety first, buckle up. You see the cameras prop up and everything when you're reversing out. Take out a lot of the guesswork for you. Just in case a car behind you or anything like that. So, it's good. <laughs> smooth man um, it's pretty fast you know, I can put the car on autopilot if I want it let it drive me places and it just stays centered in the lane so as y'all can see hands off you got to touch it every few seconds otherwise of course it'll slow down or disengage because you still got to pay attention because you are the driver but uh you know if I want it I just let us do its thing. Pretty much. You see us turning. Got no hands. Nothing like that. So then I just disengage it with the brake. And actually, uh, Tesla's you do one pedal driving. You don't actually uh, press the brake too often. Cause as soon as you let off the gas, the car just slows down by itself. Um, if you let all the way off the gas, then it's like you're going to be slamming on your brakes pretty much because um, it has something called a regenerative braking. 
So it takes the power and kinetic energy from braking and puts it back to the battery. So Tesla's you only drive with uh, just a gas pedal. See, I got the sensors popping up just in case anything on my right, my blind spot. Shout out to acceleration. It's pretty fast, zero to 60 in three seconds. Yeah, man, so that's gonna wrap up to today's video. Um, let me know in the comments if y'all wanna see anything specific. I'll do a whole video on that subject. Um, so just let me know. That's gonna conclude today's, you know, just start a video on the Tesla and the brand in general. I think they're a great brand. I don't think they get the recognition that they deserve. And I think that um, the media, people in general, are just very uneducated about them and the car itself. So, you know, let me know what y'all want to see next. Just follow, subscribe, like the video, recommend it to your people. I uh, appreciate y'all. Have a good one.